we have learned counting in twos, counting in fives and counting in tens. Now we will be moving on to counting in threes. So we will be doing counting in threes. So we will write three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen, twenty one, twenty four, and so on. We will be counting in threes. We will use the number line to count in threes. So I'm going to draw the number line. So we'll start with three, six, sorry. So we will be writing the numbers. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. So we have, we have the number line and now when we want to jump or count in threes we will start from so so it will start from three six nine twelve fifteen eighteen twenty one and so on so we count in threes we'll jump count in threes so by learning counting in threes we will be able to do the table three so now i'm going to teach you an easy method of learning table three so now we are familiar with table two table five and table ten next we will move on to table three so by using the counting in threes method you can do the table three so now we are going to do the table three and I'm going to teach you an easy method of doing or of learning table three. So we have a grid three by three grid up and down. So we start by writing the numbers from one to nine from down. So in the ones place we first start writing. So we start writing in the bottom grid, we start from the bottom grid, we write 1, 2, 3. This is the ones place and we come down again. So we start from bottom, top, again come down to bottom and top. So 4, 5, 6, we come down again, 7, 8, 9. And we write zero at the side here. We write a zero. So we start from the bottom grid. So we start with one, two, three. So this is the ones place. So one, two, three. We come down again. Four, five, six. Again down. Seven, eight, nine. So we write the numbers from one to nine and zero on the outer side of the box. Now. In the first column we write, on the first row we write, in the tens place we write 0. So in the tens place we write 0 against 3, 0 against 6 and 0 against 9. So this is the tens place. So first we start off by writing the numbers from 1 to 9. So we start from the bottom grid, 1, 2, 3, bottom to top. Then we come down again to the bottom 4, 5, 6, again we come down to the bottom 7, 8, 9 and on the outside we write a 0. Then in the topmost column we write in the tens place we write 
0 at the side of the numbers and in the second row we write in the tens place we write number 1. So 1, 1 and 1. So we write 1 in the tens place and we come to the bottom most row and we write 2 in the tens place we write 2. So 2, 2 and 2 and at the side of 0 in front of 0 we write 3. So now we have our table 3. So 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27 and 30. So this is a simple method of learning table 3. So I will repeat it once more. So we have a 3 by 3 box and we start off from the bottom most. We write numbers from 1 to 9. So from bottom to top. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So this is in the 1's house and on the outside we write 0. Now coming to the 10's place, in the first row we write 0 in the 10's place against the other 3 numbers. And in the second row we write 1 in the 10's place and in the last row we write 2 in the 10's place and at the side of 0 we write number 3 and we can verify our table 3. So our table 3 is 3 times 1 is equal to 3, 3 times 2 is equal to 6, 3 times 3 is equal to 9, 3 times 4 is equal to 12, 3 times 5 is equal to 15, 3 times 6 is equal to 18, 3 times 7 is equal to 21, 3 times 8 is equal to 24, 3 times 9 is equal to 27 and 3 times 10 is equal to 30. So if we verify it with our grid or the box we will know. So 3 times 1 is 3, 3 times 2 is 6, 3 times 3 is 9, 3 times 4 is 12, 3 times 5 is 15, 3 times 6 is 18, 3 times 7 is 21, 3 times 8 is 24, 3 times 9 is 27 and 3 times 10 is 30. So by learning counting in threes it will make learning of table 3 even more simpler.